Damn! Don't waste this plane! Heron! Oh shit! Dom, no! No, 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 no! I'm the same as you. The eyes! Declaration of war! Guys, yo, what's good, everybody? Hope y'all doing well, man. You already know what day it is. It's Attack on Titan Day, baby. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support you guys are showing on the Attack on Titan series so far. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it as much as I am because last episode, absolutely loved it. We focused more on Reiner's backstory. It added a lot more weight to the previous scenes that we've seen in past seasons, especially, you know, the the attack on the wall, his interactions with, with Annie and Berthold and and you know a little bit more behind the scenes on marcel's death it just added a lot more weight to not only his character but like i said like some of the scenes that we've seen before it just it's it's amazing bro and of course we saw that man at the end of the last episode aaron yeager he was talking to falco he seemed determined as hell he was on his philosophy type beat and of course they haven't said like yo this is aaron yeager but i called before in episode two that like this dude looks so similar to aaron and of course as soon as i saw those green blue whatever dead eyes that he has right now and um the voice actor i'm like dude this is 100 percent aaron yeager so i'm excited to see what's in store for us in the taco time because you guys are saying that this episode and like the next couple of episodes peak fiction like this is it bro like this is like everything that we've been wanting from attack on titan so I'm excited, guys. We're in here, episode 63, from one hand to another. If you guys haven't already, make sure to subscribe because it says that about 70% of you guys that watch my videos aren't subscribed. So make sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. It takes like one second. Super easy, and you can always change your mind later. And also make sure to click that like button. It really helps your boy out a lot. By the way, guys, before we start, we're going to thank our good friends over at Surfshark VPN for sponsoring today's video. If you sign up right now using my special link, surfshark.deal slash ivory, down below in the description, and also enter my special code ivory, you can save 84% off and also get a four x extra months totally for free having a vpn is almost essential in the day and age we live in now especially during lockdown while we're all trying to stay connected and entertained through the internet and having the ability to surf the web you know stream upload download without the risk of having your sensitive information being leaked or even hacked right now like that just it's almost a necessity at this point like it's so important to have that privacy and that security for your information speaking of staying entertained and streaming one of my favorite features of surfshark vpn is actually the ability to change your region to whatever country you want so stuff that was previously unavailable in whatever your specific location was is now free for you to watch surfshark vpn also has an app on your phone that you can use so whenever you're out in public man you know using public wi-fi you don't have to worry about your sensitive information being just plastered wide out in the open for people to see so like i said before guys i got you guys with the hookup man just click the link down below in the description surfshark.deal slash ivory and enter the code ivory to get 84 percent off and four extra months totally for free guys make sure to get on that while you can and thank you surfshark vpn once again for sponsoring this video all right guys we in here let's talk on time what you got in store for your boy today also i think the festival is about to start if i'm not wrong so happy episode because so far everything's been kind of depressing mr kruger mr kruger that's what the owl's name was this man falco delivering letters for him i mean the vibes for that was kind of happy it was a little wholesome i don't know why but now we get this World War II-esque opening right here. So Falco right now is delivering letters for Mr. Kruger, even though it's Aaron. I, I know that a lot of people didn't agree with me when I said I liked this opening the first time I heard it, but I still love it to this day. Here it is, from one hand to another, bro. That's a dope-ass title name, too. The Tiber family. God damn, these dudes looking diesel. You see how tall this boy is? Jesus. Willie, my man, Willie. <laughs> God damn, I can oh, hear all these kids playing outside. Jesus. It's too real. Oh, they're not even laying outside. They're in the room. <laughs> they're in the room. That's what the fuck. This dude's like, what the hell is going on? So, so Willie's like, dude, the Warhammer Titan is here. It's one of us. Can you figure out who it is? Damn, I don't even know. It's probably gonna be like a kid. This dude looks cool too. I like his his design a lot. Damn. So basically, Willie's like, dude. Um, Marley did this like this path of war by themselves, even though like this whole nation is controlled by the Tiber family. Oh, but he's taking responsibility for it. He said, "This man trying to become Hel Helos, like in the legend." He just said, "That man, that man, Galliard." God damn. Uh, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, dude. Why? Why is she looking kind of? Why is she looking kind of thick, though? Can anyone answer my question? She got a whole dump truck back there, bro. 
I'm about to act up. <laughs> this is poor girl's like, ah, what the hell are you doing? Because <laughs> she's the car tight. She's like, it's more natural for me. Oh, so they're, they're planning the uh, the attack on Paradise Island, right? Damn. They do mad racist, though. He said, it was dumb to let the Eldian talk. We just can't win out here. Dude, the crew looking, the crew looking kind of saucy right now, dude. Oh, shit. Falco, let's go, bro. Let's go, Falco. Okay. That man, Falco, got that keem star speed. He was running. He said, yo, I'm about to become the armor tie-in, Gabby. Hey, hey, let that man Falco dream. He might, he might surpass Gabby. <laughs> Everyone's gassing him up. He's like, you, you beat Gabby. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn, Gabby mad as fuck. Yeah, Gabby, we get it. You good. You capable soldier and all. Let my, let my man Falco have his praise, bro. Damn, that dude Falco got some fighting words. He said, hey, no one's been announced yet. No winner's been announced for the armored. Oh, right. Yes, sir. <laughs> Okay, I'm doing it for you. He said it. <laughs> Yo, the guard's like, he totally said it. <laughs> the music right now. Okay, dude. <laughs> the vibes for today's episode right now are just like, they're kind of wholesome. I mean, I'm keeping it real. I wouldn't mind a wholesome episode because like I said, everything has been kind of depressing so far. I would like a little, little decompression, a little funny moments, you know? She about to poke his ass out. And they got that bread on deck. This episode is funny so far, dude. Of course, Gabby again, bro. Now she looking mad creepy. You looking like a titan right now, low-key. Dude, this whole group, the clownery right now. Gabby cannot go one scene without her without gassing herself up, bro. Whoa. That OST came in a little bit. Oh shit, he back. Dude, that's actually Aaron. Like, there's no way. Like, there, there's no disputing the fact. Like, if you don't know at this point, come on, bro. Man, got a baseball glove. You need to move forward. It looks it looks a little happy right there. When the festival is over, he'll go back to his hometown, huh? Jaeger, a physician for the zone. Your name your name's Jaeger too? Bro, this is kind of messing with my head a little bit. Damn, okay. So the doc's like, bro, you gotta stop asking him to do shit for you. Like, you're gonna all his effort will be for naught. Wait. I don't know why it took me so long to realize this. This is his fucking grandpa. It, am I wrong? Isn't this his fucking grandpa? Look, look, look. This, that, 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 no, no, no. That, that's Grisha's dad. I swear, I swear, I swear. It's Grisha's dad. Cause he's like, I was too strict about him becoming a doctor. He was also, he was always pushing Grisha to become a doctor. And then Grisha's sister got eaten by the dogs, right? My son took my daughter outside the wall. This, this is his. Bro, bro, I don't, bro, 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 bro. I was wondering, dude. I was wondering why I'm like, dude, it's kind of weird how his name is Jaeger too, bro. Cause like, I mean, I was thinking in my head, bro. You know, Jaeger, you know, it's not that common of a name, but you know, it's definitely not rare for a person to have the same name or like a same last name as another, you know, it's totally not that rare, right? So I was like, oh, it's kind of cool. His name's Jaeger too, he's talking to Aaron Jaeger. And it's like, yo. This is the his fucking grandpa. He's talking about, yeah, dude. He's strict about him becoming a doctor. That dude was losing it, so he he still has that regret of pushing his ideals on his son. And you know that transferred when Grisha was pushing his ideals to Zeke, which caused Zeke to betray them. Bro, oh my god, that's actually kind of nutty, bro. That's actually kind of crazy. I do. Woo! This man is having a, a mental breakdown, dude. Right in front of everybody. Aaron just... He ain't even feeling anything. Damn. Never mind. He looking kind of sad right there. He got the baseball, though. Ooh, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Ooh. Ooh, that shit was going, bro. That shit was going, man. Okay, hold on. Tiber family, family, and nobles are revolted against Eldian in the Great Time War 100 years ago. They joined hands with the Marlin hero Helos to overcome the Eldian Empire and bring an end to the war. As nobles who have long possessed the Warhammer Titan, they have guided Marley for many years and hold a significant influence both domestically and abroad. Currently, Willie Tiber is the head of the family. We saw him already. Um, he looks kind of cool. Yo. Damn, that was a crazy scene, dude. Crazy scene. Bro, the best part of Attack on Titan has to be when you get like certain pieces of puzzle. And when like a scene appears, you just piece it together. And it's like the best feeling ever. It's like, holy shit, dude. All right, let's continue, guys. And hold on, we getting fancy in here, dude. We got the suits on and everything. We get it, Gabby. All right, chill out. 
Come on. They really try harding out here being waiters and waitresses. And they still being racist to us. Come on, dude. Ooh. Oh, yikes. Big yikes, dude. Damn, she really covered for us right there. I was about to say, we were about to get executed. I don't know why, but <laughs> the name Willie, dude. He's like the head of everything. Oh, no, we got some. Oh, hold on. We got some melanin representation out here. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to lie. This is pretty dope right here. This is pretty dope. Dude, everyone's looking at this dude like they want to kill him. Yeah, yeah. Let that man Willie take over. Hold on. <laughs> They're like, yeah, 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 Willie. <laughs> He's about to reveal the solution. Willie, what, what we got? What's this man Willie got in store for us? It's tomorrow. Oh, shit. That <laughs> that girl Gabby was slumped. Oh, it's the parade or like the the festival now, right? Yeah, everything everything looks fun to me. And they got the ice cream on deck. Like I can't stop smiling. It, it just seems so happy right now. That man Reiner, dude. Reiner, smile a little bit, bro. Come on. Look at this dude, Reiner. He's just paying for everything. Come on, Reiner. Give me a smile. There we go, boy. Give me a little smile right there. Yo, the Edie's playing. You know when the Edie plays, some shit's about to go down, right? Oh, it's about to be a major ass cliffhanger. About to change, huh? Look at this foreshadowing right here. Oh, you can't do that to me, bro. Wait, 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 wait. I got blue balled so heavy right there. Like, I felt like the ED is playing. It's leading up to something. Bam, cuts off to the actual ED. Oh, no. Okay, let's just continue, bro. Shit. This was a fire episode, though. This was absolute fire. Oh shit, there isn't anything. Okay. And man Zeke here and everything. What's up? He said he saw someone in here. Oh shit, he's with that man Aaron. That man Kruger. Yo! This man Falco about to. Oh no, 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 no. Falco. Fal Fal hold on, hold on, hold on. My heart's not ready. My heart's not ready, dude. If I think what he's doing, is he about. Okay. Is he about to show Reiner Kruger right now? He's like, yo, check out this cool dude. You know, Kruger, I found him. Falco, you might have just doomed this all. That man Aaron might go fucking sicko mode when he sees Reiner, dude. I don't know how, Re I mean, I assume Aaron still feels some type of se sentiment and some type of anger towards Reiner. He probably wants to kill him. You might have just doomed the Reiner's life right here. Bro, okay. <sighs> Enough stalling. I'm here. No bitches. We in here. Let's go. Oh, no, dude. Damn. No, it's these playing. Aaron. Oh, shit. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Preview. Preview. Let me see the preview. Reiner confronts Aaron. The crowd is absorbed by Lister. Aaron admits. I'm the same as you. The eyes! Declaration of war! Guys. Guys, dude. Guys. Guys, I can't wait, dude. I can't wait another week. I can't wait another week, dude. There's not... I'm not gonna be able to live for another week. I need to know what happens, dude. This was a cliffhanger and a half right here. Yo! Fuck, man. That dude's eyes. You you saw Aaron's eyes, bro? Them, them shits were... Yo, here's the man look like he's about to turn into the Hulk out here. This episode was fucking fire as hell, dude. Oh, there was so much great things about it. I loved, absolutely loved how the wholesome parts, like, you know, like the, the squad just playing with each other. You know, the warriors all talking, they look all saucy and stuff. So, I don't know. It was just a really fun episode. And the fact that they ended off with this. Oh, God, bro. Yo, I cannot wait for this next episode. All I'm saying, Falco, you might have just doomed us all right there. I'm not going to lie. Falco, you might have just doomed us all. But he says, I'm the same as you. I, I don't know if Aaron's going to. Well, Aaron did. Well. They did say that Aaron requested for Falco to bring Reiner to him. So maybe Aaron had the shit planned all along. But you know, that man Reiner noticed instantly that that was Aaron. Instantly. He was like, Aaron? Oh shit. Even with like the whole getup going on. Whoo! Fire episode, guys. Fire episode. And now we wait. Next episode. I feel like the next episode, dude. 
Shit's it's it's getting to that point right now. It's getting to that point. Pieces are starting to fall together. Aaron's here. Where's the rest of the squad? The scouts though. I don't know though. But hey. Woo! Fire episode, guys. All right, guys. Um, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys did enjoy, man. It really helps your boy out a lot. You can always change your mind later. We're trying to get that 100,000 subscri subscribers together. I'm fucking spinning out here. I'm stuttering, but I don't care because Attack on Time, this shit is great.